Let's take a quick second to look at how you delete a notebook from your list of notebooks. You always have the option over here in your list of notebooks on the right of my screen. You can right click on a notebook and you can close it. That only closes it out of that list. It doesn't delete it officially. So you actually delete a notebook out of OneDrive and here on the screen you see the instructions on how to do this. If you want a step by step how to, just pause your screen and you can follow this, this step and you should be good. I'm going to go ahead and go through the steps here on the screen though for those of you that would rather see it through video format. Once you get over to your OneDrive folder, you're going to be looking in a couple different areas. Number one, you can be looking in your top level files folder. You'll see when I get to the end of my file folders, I actually have just regular files and this is where I'm going to find a lot of my regular notebooks. But if you've created a class notebook, you're going to want to look under the C's and you'll see a folder for class notebooks. When you click in that, you'll see a list of all of the different class notebooks that you might have. And you may also find some of your notebooks under a folder just labeled as notebooks. And here are different notebooks that you have also. Is I'm going to toggle over here to my OneDrive and I'm going to find the notebook that I want to get rid of. And so for my case, I'm going to go ahead and say that I'm going to get rid of this elementary and secondary instructional tech notebook. And what I would do is I would make sure that I click the little radio icon or radio button next to the icon. I would come up here and I would click delete. Now that doesn't finish the product process though. If you have this notebook open in your uh, desktop version, you also need to go and close that out. So you would go back to your notebook. You would come over here. We're going to pretend that this is the same notebook. And again, I would say right click and close. And at that point, that notebook then would no longer try to sync and you won't get any error messages. So that's what you do to get rid of a notebook. Again, if that doesn't work for you, if you don't find yours in your OneDrive list, that means that you've got a notebook created somewhere else and the process may have a little different slant to it. But hopefully this helps get rid of most of the notebooks that you need.